That's a lie, right? Himiko did such a thing? Hey guys. In the end, that was a bit of a light intro. <laughs> who Tenko cherished and loved, tragically killed her. Whoa. Wait, we don't know that, right? I didn't even stop. He's wrong, the right, Himiko? Himiko would never kill Tenko. Right? <sighs> kill Tenko? I killed Tenko? Himiko? What's wrong, Himiko? <laughs> it is true that using the middle room was Himiko's idea. But does that mean that Himiko really killed Tenko? Would something like that really happen? Something so cruel? Oh, there we go. Yes, I would like to save. Indubitably. Does not compute. Huh? Did you hear something? No, I didn't hear anything. You know what else is scary? Sweet buns. Yep, tasty, tasty sweet buns. So round, so sweet, so delicious. That doesn't sound scary at all. I'm scared too. Scared of losing my friends. Huh? Did you hear something? No, mm. I didn't hear anything. Answer us, Himiko. You chose the middle room to lure us into your trap, did you not? Then you used that trap to kill Tenko, yes? Well, Donkey Lips, did you kill that twat? Wait, must be some mistake. No way Himiko is caught. Then she needs to defend herself. Otherwise, this debate is deadlocked. <laughs> I don't care if you gotta use magic to do it, but say something already. Are you even listening? No, I'm not listening. What? I... I don't care anymore. I'm too tired. Angie died. Tanko died. Why did I have to survive? And now, <sighs> you're all saying I killed them? I just don't care anymore. Himiko. Do whatever. If you want to vote for me, then just go ahead. Uh, the game gets really blah if the suspect isn't into it. Damn it! Don't tell me you've given up! Himiko, don't give up! Don't you understand? My life is riding on the outcome of this trial! Just shut up. I told you, I'm too tired. It's all just a big pain. I can't put up with it anymore. Well, what are you talking about? If you give up here... You needn't worry. Himiko was the one who chose that room. Therefore, she is unmistakably the culprit. Uh, impossible! Himiko would never kill Tanko! Himiko, not that kind of person! Gota can tell by Himiko's face! Himiko's a little... slow, so I don't think she's capable of handling a complicated crime. I also think Himiko's not the culprit. Um, somehow... Either way, we gotta look for more possibilities. <laughs> that does seem like rather a pointless quest. No, it's not. We gotta be strong. Gotta keep thinking. Then we might find new truth. 
So no give up, Himiko. Himiko, I know how you feel. I felt the same way after Kaede died. But we can't give up. We survived. We can't give up. For the sake of everyone who died. Performing the seance in that room was Himiko's decision, was it not? What if someone steered her into picking that room? Of the three empty rooms, why did you select the middle one, Himiko? Because you laid your trap. When his hands was held, he had stepped through one of the floorboards. That room has also had a part of the cross piece cut off. The portion that. Oh! There. Was trap only in that room? So all of them had a part of the cross Other piece. rooms may be trapped too! I agree! Ah! It's just like Gonta said. Each room was the same. They were all trapped. What? Is that true? Yes. Kokichi will tell you. Maybe not. <laughs> I was way too careless. Uh, wait, what are you talking about? I guess it was up past the support of this four bug so I kind of stepped through. Uh huh, huh. Well, bad luck. While you were in the room next to the crime scene, you found a loose floorboard, right? Well, I didn't find it so much as I stepped through it and tripped. What? Hold on! There was also a loose floorboard in the next room? So, so the culprit prepared a trap in all three empty rooms, not just the middle one. If the culprit set traps in all the rooms, then they wouldn't need to select a room themselves. So the real trap was for someone else to pick a room and take the blame. I see. We were caught in the culprit's trap all along. Especially you! But now there's no reason to suspect Himiko, right? Himiko, do you remember what Tanko told you? <laughs> Yeah, we've already read this like five minutes ago. True! Live life facing forward. She said that to you, right? If you give up on living, you'd be betraying her memory. We're all trying to keep our promises to the dead. This trial, it's not just for our lives. It's Bye. for everyone who's died as well. By we all? Um, he just means you and Shuichi. He just yep. means you and himself. <laughs> That's why we can't give up. This is our responsibility. We live on. You're right. <clears throat> yeah, that's right. If I gave up here, I wouldn't be able to face Angie or Tinko. That's right. So let's do our best. <laughs> All right. I'm not going to say it's a pain anymore. I won't give up. I'll fight alongside everyone and survive. Do not say hey. everyone. After all, the blackened is still among us. Hey, there you go. Killing the mood like usual. Hmm. Oh, damn. Well said, Shuichi. That's what I'd expect from my soul, bro. Your soul, bro? Well, anyway, do you think the Blackened this time has some sort of superpower? What are you talking about? Well, as a self-proclaimed expert of stepping through floorboards... Isn't it weird that no one stepped through that floorboard before the culprit used it? Ah, that is a good point. There must have been barrier magic. Well, that's one possibility, 
But I think it might have been something else. The circle. Why did no one step on the floorboard until it was used for murder? For the murder. Ah, oh, that's it. That must be the reason. Where are ya? I know it's here. This is it! Boy! It's because of the magic circle at the scene of the crime. And that leaves us to suspect Keo. Also, it's dark in here, so be sure to watch your step. If the magic circle is broken, not only will the seance fa fail, seance, but it may also unleash a curse. Before we began the seance, we were warned not to step on the circle. The floorboard in question was within the circle. That's why no one stepped on it. So the magic circle's purpose was to keep us away from the whole trick. That was part of the culprit's plans too? That's right. If that's the case, then the culprit. There's no doubt in my mind. They're the, uh, they're the one who killed Tenko. Only one person had the opportunity in the motive. Or, or in the whatever it said. What did it say? Oh, whatever. Um. It has to be you! Kyo. And the motive. Was yeah. it you? Hmm. Whatever are you talking about? I'm talking about Tenko's murder. I figured it out a while ago, bruv. Why do you suspect me? Even if he killed Tenko, it doesn't matter because you need to find the Angie's killer. Yeah. Because you were the I one know. who drew the magic circle. The circle kept us from discovering the seesaw trick. But that's not all it was for. In order to make the murder succeed, variables like Tenko's position and the placement of the cage needed to be defined. And those variables were defined by using the magic circle. In short, the circle itself was the most important tool in this murder. Knowing that, the person who drew the magic circle has to be the culprit. Well, Keo? Answer already! Did you do it? What is so funny? I was just thinking. So this is how each blackened must have felt. What an intriguing experience this is. What? An intriguing experience? But if I am the culprit as you claim, then I stomped on the floorboard, yes? So, do tell. How could I have stomped on the floorboard during that darkened seance? Uh... I see. That is problem. <laughs> Unless that is made clear, you cannot be certain I am the culprit. How can you be so calm when you're backed into a corner like this? You, I will explain you that your hands. Please <laughs> my question first. You're on the right track. The culprit stepped on... Oh. The salt. He would have, he would have, um, because he would have known what part of the salt it would have been at, so he would have felt the salt, and then, just, yeah, like, sort of like the, um, the rope thing in the, no, not really, but, oh, oh, well, we'll see. The culprit stepped on that exact floorboard, even in the darkness, but how? How did they move around into the total darkness? In a room that dark, it's hard to imagine the culprit found the right board. Although, even after I put out the candle, I could move along the wall with my hand. Wait a minute. Did you figure it out? That's it. The culprit didn't even have to see it all. They used. 
Oh, or smell. Six cents. Six cents. Smell. No. No. Touch. Hearing. Hearing? I'm kidding. It's touch. That's it! <laughs> what was I thinking? Smell. The culprit used touch. I don't know. They didn't see. They felt. I thought you were saying it doesn't work. That way work. they could get around in the dark. Like how I got to the candle. Wasn't Seesaw in middle of room? Gonta doesn't think it was near wall. It's near salt. So they probably used something besides the wall to move then, right? The floor. Were there any other markers within reach? Of mm -hmm. course, the answer to that is there was nothing of the sort. That's bullshit. No, I'm sure there was something. A landmark they could have used. A, that would have obviously told everyone that it was the soul. A landmark. I mean, to determine where the floorboard was. It must have been the scene. It must have been at the scene. I know it. Do I have to point at it? Oh. Uh, S -A. Floor something. Floor B O A R D S. Floorboards. I'm gonna check the answer and see if it's bullshit. Uh, it's floorboards. Is it? Oh. No. Um, is the first word floor? No, it starts with an M. Uh, mm, it's pretty, pretty easy. Mm, what is the salt? Mm, what is the salt? What was he using the salt to make? A. Mm, do I know this word? <laughs> yes, of course. A ma magic trick. <laughs> magic? Oh, magic circle. Yeah. Um, crap, what was the... What was the key again? I saw it down bottom right there. Oh, that was an eye. Oh. There you go. Awesome. Please be. Yeah. I didn't know if that was an F or an E. That's it. The magic circle. They used the magic circle. Yeah, boy. It's time Remember for you who am friends. The magic circle was drawn with salt. He's not going. The culprit used the salt's texture. To feel their way through the dark. Boy, how did I get there from so first? So trace the magic circle with his without the, like to way to before this. Oh, I see. You drew the magic circle with salt to use mm -hmm. it as a guide. Why don't you say I, I'm on the right track when I got it completely correct? Is Josie? An interesting thought. It is unfortunate that it is so wrong. What? So you did do it and you're just saying you didn't. 
What did the magic circle look like? Here you go. It's just right Based on the document, the magic circle wouldn't reach the corners oh. of the room. Is he saying that he was... Wait, what? So what? When the room was darkened, each of us was in a corner of the room, yes? The magic circle didn't reach us, so I could not have followed it, yes? But you're talking about the magic circle in the document. Just walk a bit forward and guess. That doesn't mean the circle you drew was the same. There's more to it. No, I most definitely drew it exactly the same. I have it perfectly memorized. Um, so which is it? Is there any way to check? Not anymore. Of there is. The magic circle is a complete mess from being trampled on. Your yeah, boy. I see another piece of the puzzle. They talk to him about checking the circle. It's always the book. No. Well, trying the circle with so. No, no, no. All but guaranteed it would be temporary. The investigation itself would have gotten rid of the evidence. Clever. But we've got bloody um Kibo. Everyone, may go. I have your attention please? There is. Hmm, what a pain. We don't have any way to check it now. Excuse me, everyone. May I have your attention please? Well, I guess there's no point in discussing the magic circle anymore. Hey, may I have your attention? Oh, I said cut that out. It's too bright. I apologize. I just wanted everyone to listen to me. About what? I had Mew add another function to my body, in addition to the flashlight. What the? No way! Did you really... I didn't install it for that per Please, let me use it. With it, I might be able to save everyone. All right, so what is this function? It's an image recording function. Image recording? Specifically, this function allows me to dispense a printout of my own memory. I'll give it a try. Ready? We're gonna... Oh, okay. From your mouth? Where? I've also used magic like that before. This printout is my memory of being kicked out of the seance. Please confirm that the floor of the empty room is clearly visible. Go on. Take the picture and see for yourself. Uh, okay. Got it. I reluctantly took the paper from Kibo's mouth. No, so, different. this is the magic circle used for the seance. We may notice anything different. Do you notice anything different from the one in the book? Um, I can't remember what the one in the book looked like. It's nothing really that specific. It's just a... Uh... God, do I really have to? Wait, so let me. Remember what Q was trying to say? Who? It wouldn't have been able to feel his way there. Oh, you're just talking about the size? No. There's a trail at the, the lines. Yeah. yeah. I don't know you're talking about that. You said it wasn't something that specific. Well, Shuichi, do you notice anything? Notice anything? What? That's where um, he was standing, right? Mm hmm. There! This helped a lot, Kibo. 
Without you, I never would have seen through Keo's lie. My lie? You just said that you drew the magic circle exactly as it appears in the document. But that's a lie, isn't it? The magic circle at the scene had lines that stretched to the room's corners, which means that you would be able to find the floorboard from anywhere in the room. So it was different from the document after all. All because Himiko noticed. And because of Kibo, too. Hey, where's my thanks? I'm the one who installed that function into Kibo. Hey, yeah, what was it you were saying about its purpose? Oh, to be honest, the purpose of that image recording function is to monitor my health. Specifically, I make Kibo use that function every day to... <sighs> analyze my turds! Your what? Why? What? Shit is a great indicator of intestinal health and gut bacteria quality! Plus, taking a satisfying shit does wonders for a woman's natural beauty, so... See? You're all grossed out! This is why I didn't want to tell you about my plan! Quit talking about your poop. No one cares. Jesus. Kyo, you killed Tanko, didn't you? Just give up and admit it already. So, Kyo. If you have any objections, you can... Your deductions are fiction. Well, since you've given me the option, I will most certainly object. To be honest, it's unimportant. But it may be an amusing diversion. Unimportant? Now I shall bear witness to your ability, Shuichi. Do entertain me. If you are going to claim I am the culprit, then what of the murder weapon? It was set up in the cage. The only people capable of that are Kokichi and Shuichi, who carry the cage. So suspicion should fall on them. Oops. If you are going to claim I am the culprit, then what of the murder weapon? It was set up in the cage. The only people capable of that are Kokichi and Shuichi who carry the cage. So suspicion should fall on them. Mm. True, we could have placed the sickle there, but we could not have removed it later. Because we weren't the ones who lifted the cage. That was Himiko. The only person who could have collected the sickle is he. But the only people who could have placed the sickle are Kokichi and Shuichi. But in regards to that dilemma, I did not carry the cage, nor did I lift it. I had no opportunity to touch the sickle. Boy, your words. you took the shade off. Mm -hmm. The only person who could have set up the sickle and retrieved it afterward is Kyo. That was done by covering the cage with a white cloth. You could have secretly placed the sickle when you draped the cloth. And retrieved it afterward when you removed the cloth. No, it was just this one clue that got me suspicious of Keo. You know? The white cloth. He and took the white cloth off. Everyone was distracted. He discreetly dropped the sickle under the floor. Wonderful! That's exactly correct. What? It's correct? Then why don't you give up already? Well... Doesn't mean he killed the first person, that's probably why he's admitting it. <laughs> the trick I put so much work into... is just wasted effort now. Alas. So... it was you? You killed Tinkle? Let me guess. You'll never forgive me. Himiko, you must hate me so very much. 
Maybe you'd feel better if I was executed by Monokuma. But unfortunately for you, that won't happen. Because if you vote for me, every spotless, including myself, will die. What you talking about, Kyo? <laughs> you still don't understand? I killed Tenko, that is the truth. But it is meaningless in this class trial. Meaningless? You mean How have we not Monokuma's figured it? Extra rule, right? <laughs> ah, that's right. What happens to your votes if there are two black and candidates? Well, I have an answer for that. It first come, it's first come, first served. You see, I killed Tenko, but not Angie. For us, Tenko's death is nothing but a trivial issue. Because the blackened in this trial is the culprit who killed Angie. A uh, trivial issue? No, that's gotta be a lie. You probably killed Angie too. Did Him Himiko kill Angie? That is simply not possible. Recall that I was unable to enter Angie's lab. Oh, only student council members and Kokichi could enter research lab. How could I have possibly killed Angie when I couldn't even enter her lab? We can figure that out. No one else could have done it besides you. If you're the one who killed Tenko, you gotta be the one who killed Angie! I understand how you feel, Himiko, but maybe we can discuss this rationally and calmly. There is a non-zero possibility that Kyo is telling the truth. So you understand how she feels. I see. Wait, robots can understand human feelings? Uh, of course I understand. I work really hard to understand. Hey, why are you getting all worked up, Kibo? Chill, dude. That's enough! It's voting time! I'm gonna vote for him! <laughs> Voting for me. I know who I'm voting for. The one who murdered Angie. Yeah. Kaito. <laughs> Yo, <Kyo> culprit. <laughs> True. Of course I'm not. This case was an error on my part. Monokuma added that rule after both bodies were found. Yes. How was I to know that the trial would only be for Angie's killer? Had I known, I certainly wouldn't have killed Tenko. Um. <laughs> What's happening again? You're lying! You killed Tango oh, and. Okay, I'm saving. <laughs> yeah, I have to save, save, please. An Angie. Now hold on. Jumping to conclusions here is dangerous. Mm-hmm. We should talk it out more. This case might have juicy plot twists waiting to happen. Nuts to that. Any way you look at this case, Keo is obviously the culprit. Yeah, there's sort of no other way to look at it. No, it's too dangerous to vote before we arrive at a logical decision. The culprit from the bed. is getting intense at times like this the ultimate academy is proud to present its very own more phenomenal trial round yippee oh, i've been waiting for this mm -hmm. why were you waiting for it Kyo confessed to killing tanko but insists he didn't kill angie we won't forgive Kyo for what he did but we can't vote until we know the facts. We have to pin down the evidence and convince everyone. Is everyone an idiot? Why would you do? Why would you vote from straight, like straight on, without the facts? I don't know. You say that as if it's a spoiler. <laughs> it is. Uh, I'm sure it is. Ma 
Aki's on their side. Yeah. Oh. We don't know for certain that Kyo killed Angie. He forced his way into Angie's research lab and killed her. Kyo. Uh. Anyone could have entered my lab. The katana what, was really? found in what? Kyo's lab. Kyo. That's lab. Anyone could have entered my lab. <laughs> okay. So Kyo did kill Tanko, but he not blackened? Kokichi does Perhaps there's a second blackened we need to find. He's planning to use the new rule to protect himself all along. Kyo! Not possible. That rule was added after both murders. We solved the mystery of Tanko's death. I got this! So Not now yet. know that that one's There's Angie. still another mystery to solve. He forced his way into. Kyo killed Tanko and Angie! Kibo! We don't know for certain that Kyo killed Angie. He forced his way into Angie's research lab and killed her! I got this! But he couldn't get into Angie's research lab. The katana was found! Kyo! Anyone could have entered my lab. So Kyo did kill Tanko, but he's not Kokichi. Perhaps there's a second blackened we need to find. He's planning to use the new rule to Kyo. Not possible. That rule was added after both murders. We solved the mystery. I got this. Not yet. There's still another mystery to solve. Yeet. Ball, what you got? Oh crap. Oh, W. to vote before we've completely solved Angie's <laughs> Oh, he fired. Shoichi. He's got like a hole in his pants. Yeah. Mystery? What kind of mystery? Well, Kyo's confession derailed our conversation a bit. But we still have to go over one of the clues found at Tanko's crime scene. I believe it might even have something to do with Angie's murder. <laughs> yes, the outlying piece of evidence at Tenko's murder scene. Oh yeah, Tenko's murder scene. Um. Uh, Wait, what was the question? Yeah, to be honest, I don't know. <laughs> Press F1. What clue found at the crime scene that hasn't been explained oh. yet? Um. Don't think of Angie's, think of Tinko's. Yeah, I know. Dry blood under four. Yeah. This is it! The blood stain found under the floor. Maki and I found it during the investigation. Because it was dry, I mean, what? what? It was beneath the floorboard was... that the culprit stomped on. Is that it looks red right there, doesn't it? Pot? Or is that just me? You can't see it there. You know Can't what? you? You, oh yeah, you're colorblind. You're partially colorblind, aren't you? Well... True. It, this this whole thing right now is brown, like a brownie sort of color. So you can't yeah, really. Yeah, like spots there. Yeah, but it wouldn't be pink if it was brownie sort of color. True. But I think I see the spots you're talking about, but it just looks a bit. It's like darker. in the middle of the screen. Yeah, it just looks a bit like a darker brown for me. Yeah. Oh. That blood stain was too far from Tanko's corpse to have been hers. It was. Also, the blood stain was already dry when we found it. But the blood from Tanko's body hadn't even begun to dry yet. That's weird. 
Why was that blood stain the only dry one? Was Angie killed there? I don't know. Actually, what? Probably not. Oh no! Blood stain under the floor, but was dry because. Wait, maybe it was. I don't know. Uh, yeah, it was there before Tinker was killed. Damn it! Um. Oh uh, no! Um. Oh, what? It happened before the sound. The air was dry. The react was from the investigation. That's it. Yeah. Whatever. The blood stain wasn't I mean, from Tenko's murder. But happened before Tenko was killed. That was a bit <coughs> stupid. I'm gonna tell Matt this, right? Matt! Huh? Get this right, sir. It was, had the four options thing, right? And there were two options mm -hmm. about the blood thingy. One was, mm -hmm. um, it was dry <laughs> because it was before Tenko was killed. And the other was, mm -hmm. it was dry because it was before the, um, before the. What's it called? For the seance. Yeah. Well, what did you choose? At first, I chose Tenko was killed because, I mean, they were the same time. <laughs> what? It was a bit stupid. Not really. How was it? The same started before she died. So shouldn't I have? Shouldn't Tenko killed been the answer? No. Nope. What? Do you even know what I just said? Yeah. Okay, so I picked. It started. Be, um, it was before Tenko was killed, and I got it wrong. Yeah. And then yeah. I picked before the seance, and I got it right. Yes. So how isn't that stupid? I don't know. Oh, what? And then he started saying it was before Tenko was killed. I think. Yes, you meant the blood stain wasn't it, from. Like, it said the, the blood stain wasn't from Tenko's murder. He starts talking about. Yeah. So like. They basically had two of the same answers. Not really. How didn't they? Because they were at different times. The seance and Tenko's murder? Yeah. No, they weren't. The seance started before she died. It's basically trying to say, did that blood scene come from the seance or before that? Did the blood stain come? If it happened during the seance, that means you would choose before Tenko, um, before Tenko died. Or if it was before the seance, then you would choose before the seance. Yeah, but it's not something you'd figure out, like, within a time limit and, like, um, without I knowing would, the answer. I would've just looked at the two answers and been like, okay. Well, I didn't see the other answer, I just saw before Tenko was killed, and I was like... Yeah. Gotta mean that. Well, you don't get much time! Play out, I'm mad. It was there before we started the seance. Before the seance? <sighs> that should make it clear whose blood it was. That's it! That blood stain wasn't Tenko's. It was Angie's. Why was blood from Angie at the scene of Tenko's murder? <coughs> yeah, wasn't Angie killed in her research lab? <laughs> no, not necessarily. Brought there, but 
Just because we found her body there doesn't mean she was killed there. Ah, I guess that's possible. If Angie wasn't killed in her lab, then that opens up a lot more possibilities. We assumed that only council members could have killed Angie since her body was in her lab. But if she died somewhere else, then we can't suspect just the council members anymore. So the culprit didn't enter her lab, but waited for her to come out of it? I'm not sure if the culprit waited for her, but they probably killed her when she came out. Well, I thought that was more likely from the start. So I went to places Angie might have gone, and checked all three empty rooms. Places she might have gone? Why did you check the empty rooms, then? Hmm? The empty rooms were the only places I could think of that Angie would go. Did Angie have business in rooms? <laughs> it seems Kokichi's up to his usual misleading nonsense again. <laughs> I do lie a lot, and I could be lying right now, too. But I'm pretty sure someone's panicking right now because of my lie. Angie left her lab on her own and headed to the room where she was killed. Is Kakiji's statement true, or...? I'm getting a lot of these. The art research lab is not where Angie was killed. She was killed in the empty room instead! She left her lab on her own. Does it say anything about leaving or something? So I don't show you if it's not obvious who the F um, effigy is supposed to be. Label it with the name of the deceased. After preparing the effigy, burn this. Um, necronomicon to ashes. Use caution, be mindful of carbon monoxide poisoning. Sprinkle the ashes on the effigy and repeat and the name of the deceased three times. And close your eyes and wait after a while. You should feel a light tap on the back. Maybe she went to bloody burn it? I don't know. Maybe. She go into an empty room. There shouldn't have been anything in there. Except for candles. Candles to burn it. She wanted a candle! Oh my god. Keep herself awake at night. She would drip. I figured it out. She wanted the candles to burn it. Can you like? There we go. I agree. That's it. Angie went to that room to get a candle. Yeah, for kinky wax play. Uh, no. Angie was going to use it for the ritual. <laughs> According to the Necronomicon, to resurrect the dead... <laughs> blah, blah, blah. I just read this. Then, did she seek out a candle so she could burn the book? That's right. There's nothing to start a fire with in Angie's lab. So she went to go get a candle from one of the empty rooms. And that's when the culprit attacked her. That's why there was dried blood under floor. That would have been scary. Which means yeah. Angie was attacked in the same room the seance was held. 
Bravo, Himiko. Well done for choosing that room for the seance. If we hadn't done the seance in that room, then Tenko's murder would have been in another room. If that happened, no one would have discovered Angie's blood stain under the floorboards. That's right. Shuichi and I only checked under the floorboards where Tenko died. Yep, it's all thanks to Himiko for choosing the same room as Angie. This must be a Tua's will. Or maybe the power of magic. Wait, what? I just missed that. So sort of daydream. <laughs> um. Um. That's why there was dry blood on the floor. Which means Angie was attacked in the same room. Which means Angie was attacked in the same room the seance was held. Bravo, Himiko. Well done for choosing that room for the seance. If we hadn't done the seance in that room, then Tenko's murder would have been in another room. If that happened, no one would have discovered Angie's blood stain under the floorboards. That's right. Shuichi and I only checked under the floorboards where Tenko died. That's right. Yep, it's all thanks to Himiko for choosing the same room as Angie. This must be a Tua's will. Or maybe the power of magic. It's neither. I just picked one. Hold on. You're all acting as though you've proven that is fact already. You claim Angie was murdered in the empty room, and then moved to the lab? Then how do you explain the large amount of blood in the lab? It may be possible to carry a body, but blood cannot be moved. A large amount of blood. What was that blood? I can't remember. Wasn't that just paint? It is blood. Hmm. No, it's blood. I don't remember. Oh, the pool of blood. Wait. Okay, I'm confused. <laughs> I don't remember, remember what the, the crime scene looked like, and they've made it all dark, so I can't see where the blood is. It's right there. She's on it. Oh, the pool of blood she's sitting on. She's lying on. Yeah. Can't even see it from here, but like, yeah, I remember. Oh, I see it now. <laughs> How do you? <laughs> okay, so the lightly coloured ones are blood, and the dark ones are. Paint. Yes. Okay. What do you think? Uh, I think she was still alive after the attack in the empty room. Um. Because she was holding the. Because of one came from. Okay, spoilers. Uh, the, the victim's body was discovered in the owner. The time of death is from. The victim was killed by a fatal stab wound to the torso. Additionally, she has lacerations on her forehead. Um. Clearly. I have no idea. In the, um... In the... I oh know. In the room, she... The only thing that she got were the lacerations on her forehead. And then mm -hmm. she, she went over to that room, and that's when the final blow was... Um, mm -hmm. the, the, um, stab wounds in the torso. Mm -hmm. There we go. Okay. Hmm. She was killed after she was carried to her lab. That means the culprit attacked her twice. I have evidence for that. I'm on a file. Yeah. What? Maybe her body? Maybe the lacerations on her forehead uh. that... The... Yeah. 
forehead injury. They both oh, do it, really. Seven. Wait, where is it? Oh. Seven. This is it. No, they both do it. It's like whatever. The fatal yeah. wound was a cut to the back of her neck from a katana. But she also showed signs of blunt force trauma, and I think I know why. After Angie was knocked unconscious in the empty room, she was killed in her lab. I see! So that puddle of blood is from the killing blow! Ha! It's all clear now! Angie was attacked in the empty room, carried to her lab, and it was there that the culprit finished her off! All clear. Why, I wonder. This is all clear. So the blood didn't drip everywhere, maybe? Probably. <laughs> what are you all talking about? All clear? What is all clear? What is... What are you... All clear? Is he the killer again? What are... You all... You... You what? What... What are... I will not fear. I will what not the heck? back down. We saw his lips. And they have like lipstick on or something. Sweet Correcchio, calm yourself. What the heck? Their words are all hollow. There is yeah. no meaning to any of them. What is, is... is it a girl? Or is it just... weird? Just weird. Just okay. Sick. What? You must teach these ignorant children a lesson. Y yes, you're right. Okay. Oh, it's just crazy. Yeah. What the hell are you mumbling about? You're giving it's me the goddamn so willies! Except... Mm-hmm. Different. Actually, no, he's more like bloody... The... Oh, what's her name? The other crazy girl. Mikan? No, the one that runs it all. Um, or her Junker. Yeah, because she has multiple personalities. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Not yet. Nothing is clear at all. It's full of doubts! Of mysteries! Of a dense, impenetrable fog! It's like, Nothing no, we haven't figured it out as you yet, but like, <laughs> you've kind of made it obvious. <laughs> What's it called? Angie was attacked in the empty room first. And then carried into the research lab? Impossible! Impossible! That's nothing but a delusion! Oh crap. <laughs> you intend to poison our minds with your delusions? I don't know what to use. It's no delusion. Angie's two I external know. wounds tell the story. After she was struck in the empty room, she was carried to the art research lab, and then killed. You say the culprit carried Angie's body? And not a single drop of blood fell? The hallway and empty room had no blood stains. Oh. Even if you wiped them down later, there'd still be traces of evidence left behind. But there was no evidence anywhere, was there, Shuichi? Uh, do I know? Mm -hmm. no... You say the culprit carried well, Angie's body, know. and not a single drop of blood fell. Bloody duct tape. The hallway and empty room had no blood stains. Oh. <laughs> What's the bloody duct tape again? Um. Okay, I guess. I I'll was use wrong. The you say the culprit carried Angie's body, and not a single drop of blood fell. The hallway and empty room had no blood stains. Even if you wiped them down later, there'd still be traces of evidence left behind. But there was no evidence anywhere, was there, Shuichi? I'll cut I guess through that your words. Contradicts it. The other one didn't really contradict. There was evidence left at the scene. The bloody tape under Angie's body. What? 
It was wrapped around her head to stop the bleeding while she was being carried. Bloody tape? Gonta didn't notice at all. It was under the body. It's most likely evidence the culprit should have gotten rid of. But since it was hidden, the culprit didn't notice and failed to dispose of it. It must have fallen as the fatal Idiot. blow was dealt and ended up under her body. It must have been Atua who did that for us. What? Atua? How long are you going to keep that up? Now we know most of the mystery behind Andy's murder. I'm convinced there's only one person who could have killed Angie. Demi. <laughs> You're the only one. <laughs> no. <laughs> Kai. It has to Only be because you. he's acting crazy. <laughs> That's the only reason I'm picking. It's you, Kyo. You killed Angie. Well, that was obvious. Such a boring, obvious answer. You killed both of them. Why? Why did you kill them? In terms of pure You're logic, me. only one victim was necessary to win. Why? Why you killed them both? I think one of the murders was an accident. An accident? What the? Uh... Um. What? <laughs> That's right. It wasn't part of the plan. Mm -hmm. Wait, so. Probably Tanker, because if he already killed Angie. Nope. What? Why would he kill Tanker anyway? He was planning on killing Tinker. Huh? He was planning on killing Tinker. I wonder why. Mm. It wasn't her huh? specific plan. Which one? You'll see. The murder that was an accident. Oh, you just told me. <laughs> yeah. That's sure it. I don't know. Angie's murder was an accident. Oh, I saw him setting it up. She saw him setting it up. Aww. Yep. What? It uh, wasn't accident? Kimu. That's right. Kyo originally planned to kill someone with a seesaw trick. But while he was making seesaw. preparations in the empty room, Angie walked in. How do you know that so Tanker decided would... to kill her? In be order like, to keep her oh, from yeah, talking. Like bloody thingy. She just happened to walk in on the culprit setting up and was killed. Then he should have just Good. stopped there. Once he killed Angie. There was no reason for him to kill Tinko. He only needed to kill one for this game. Killing two is pointless. If you get bonus points for killing more, then sure. Otherwise, it leaves more clues behind. Why, Kyo? Why you kill two of our friends? What is... What on earth are you talking about? No. I'm not the culprit. So, so why is everyone looking at me like I am? Why? Why are they? Why is it... Calm yourself, Korekio. Yes. Okay. You mustn't raise your voice. You mustn't stutter. You mustn't lose composure. You mustn't become flustered. You mustn't wait. Look at their horrid faces. This sorry lot is not worth agonizing over. You're right. Yeah. You're right. What is mom took over his body or something? There he goes again. What the hell's wrong mom. with him? What? Huh? Not his mom. His sister. Yeah. It almost seems like he's talking with someone. Someone? He's just talking to himself. And why the hell is he wearing lipstick? 
No matter how loudly you protest, this is a trivial matter. I will never. That was just joking when I said it. Not a single one of them. So you see, there is no evidence that I killed Angie. No, I will not acknowledge it. I will only acknowledge facts, true events. I won't acknowledge fiction, Miss. I won't acknowledge your deductions or guesses. Well said. Good job, Koreki. Yes, thanks. <laughs> Creeps me the fuck out! No evidence? There's no evidence that he killed Angie. You're wrong. There is evidence. And this is what, what? this is called the, you do this realize is the bluffs crow. like that won't work, yes. The weapon that was used to knock Angie unconscious in the empty room. That weapon tells us the whole story, Keo. <laughs> That's not possible. I think you may have misunderstood. Apologize. Come on, apologize. 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 Come on. Apologize. Apologize. Yeah, whatever. Seriously, what the hell's happening? I have no idea what's happening with Keo, but I know what weapon he used on Angie. I have to prove it to him. I have nothing to admit. I don't know if this, but... You are simply wrong. Yeah, I'm not the culprit. So I have nothing to confess. <laughs> I have nothing to admit. Damn. You are simply wrong. Oops. Yeah, I'm not the culprit. So I have nothing to confess. I have nothing to admit. You are simply wrong. <laughs> Why must you force your delusions on us? Your logic? That's merely a delusion. Oh crap. Well said, Correcchio. To continue this debate is meaningless. Why must you force your delusions on us? Your logic? That's merely a delusion. Well said, Correcchio. To continue this debate is meaningless. Why must you force your delusions on us? Oh crap, I didn't see that. I told you I am not the culprit. So why are you looking at me like that? You're all wrong, not me! Correggio speaks the truth. Such a sorry lot. Apologize. 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 I told you Oops. I am not the culprit. So why are you looking at me like that? You're all wrong, not me! Correggio speaks the truth. Such a sorry lot. Apologize. 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 Oh crap, I'm lost. I told you I am not the culprit. So why are you looking at me like that? You're all wrong, not me. Correcchio speaks the truth. Such a sorry lot. Apologize. 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 I can't. Apologize. I can't. I told you I am not the culprit. I don't know. like that. You're all wrong, not me. Correcchio speaks the truth. I'm, I'm new to this. Sorry, lot. This crowd. Apologize. 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 Yeah, but they've just, just chucked it in, and I don't know. I can't. So why are you looking at me like that? You're all wrong, not me. Correcchio speaks the truth. Such a sorry lot. Apologize. 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 Oh, okay. Um, I don't know. Yeah, what is you it? have no what proof you that Correggio is the killer. Uh, floor. No, I thought. Damn it. I don't know. I have no clue. I told you I am not why the didn't you read it? So why because I don't. I like only have a amount of time. You're all wrong. I just know that it's a floorboard. I to just read it and be ready to start. You have no proof so that Correggio is the killer. Removed floorboard. Yep. It ends here. 
That's all. <laughs> well, what were we talking about? Kyo hit Angie with the same floorboard he used in the seesaw oh. tree. Oh, I want to kill that, but I'm not fair. I see. That's why those And how do you know the floorboard was the murder yeah. weapon? There was a small patch of dried blood on the underside of the floorboard. Angie's blood? Blood that spattered there when the culprit struck Angie with the board. But that's not the only evidence that she was hit with that floorboard. There's also the blood stain under the floor to consider. For that to be the floorboard must not have been in place at the time of the attack. Good point. Had the floorboard been in place, her blood wouldn't have splattered beneath it. Kyo's earlier confession is further evidence that the floorboard was oh. used. How? If the weapon used to hit Angie is the floorboard from the seesaw trick. It means the culprit knew about the seesaw, so the same person killed Tenko and Angie. Huh. Uh. Ah! I believe that while Keel was setting up the seesaw, he was holding the board when Angie walked in. And he cold cocked her with the floorboard! All you can do now is accept it. You even confessed to Tenko's murder already. So it's true. This is the truth. Uh, uh, uh. Looks like we're almost at the end. All right, Shuichi, I'll leave the finale to you. Bring down the house. You think in this killing game, people would be more on edge? You know. Yeah, right. Shuichi, please. Especially at put night. an end to this. Mm -hmm. For Angie and Tanko's sake. End this class trial! Wait, so why did he still go along with killing Tenko? I'll go over everything one more time. Because it was just like, I got to set up my eyes, or just kill her anyway. Oh, but that's stupid, because that would lead people towards, you know, where she was There is killed. more to it, though. You'll see after. Kyo, we do I want you to argument. confess. No. I will force you to confess. Well, anyway, guys. Um, should we do this? An hour and twelve minutes. Should we do this um, crossing argument between episodes? Yeah. Oh.